I'd like to begin with a fact. A simple yet shocking fact. If I die, What is up guys, Scott here and we're back with a new trading video. Um, today we're going to be uh, focusing on position changes. So say like a player with a center attacking mid gets switched to a center mid or a center mid gets switched to a center defensive mid. Kind of uh, players that suit the roles that they're going to be switched into anyways. Um, and this can be done with gold, silvers, bronzes, in forms, anything you really want. Um, right now I'm going to do a little bit of a test. Um, I'll just show you. So, like, uh, Shinji Kagawa, I'm pretty sure he's a center mid, or center attacking mid this year. And, oh, I guess I can just look up. That might, uh, <laughs> that might be a little bit faster to look up his name. Um, but as you guys probably saw that I have, uh, a thumbnail over this and, uh, <laughs> and an ad running. If you, unless you have ad blocker, then, uh, then I guess you didn't see that. But you, uh, probably saw the little thumbnail and, uh, that's because I finally got partnered. Um, and so we're going to go look him up right now. Um, sorry about that. Um, we're just, I think he's about 6k maybe. The f center mid to, or center attacking mid to center mid is a little bit, uh, less coins, I guess you can say. Um, it's a, as cheap as a 6k and that one was with a artist. Sorry if you can hear that clicking, but I have to do this with one hand so it's a little bit more difficult. Um, let's see, that's a little too high. <laughs> um, I think he's probably about 6,500. So it's basically after you do that, you're going to be wanting to do a little bit of, uh, buy low sell, or yeah, buy low sell high. If you guys haven't seen, uh, a video on that, just look it up. It's pretty generic way of trading. Um, basically buy a player for less, like on bid or uh bin, if you can find one on cheap enough and then sell them for more. Pretty straightforward. Um, so his lowest buy, would buy now was about 6k, so I would say maybe search 5k, I would, that's probably a good, uh, point to start. Um, it isn't gonna get you the most coins, you can do, you have to probably do this with a lot of players, like not just focus on one player at a time. Um, as you can see there's like that one, that one has a maestro, that one has a maestro, but, um, that one is like 7 hours left. So you're not going to find too many in that, uh, I'll just search up a little bit higher. I'll go 5,300, and if I find more, um, nope. So I'm going to go to a different player. Let's go, say, like a center mid to a center defensive mid, and a player like that, let's see. Um, I'll just have to think of one. Let's just, oh, uh, no, yeah, yeah, Tori's way too much. Um... But you can use, like, Yaya Tori players that you would want to put in the center defensive mid that are already in the center mid. So I'm just going to go to a little bit of a higher rated player, or higher priced player at least. Um, let's see. G um, sorry, this is it's a little bit difficult to... Uh, oh, there he is. Um, Gundogan in a center defensive mid. People are going to be wanting to pick him up because he's, he has 75 defending. And this might be a full for somebody with a little bit more coins, but uh, you're going to be wanting to search. I think he was pro he's probably going to be about 30 to 28, 29, somewhere in between there, like 27 to 30k. I'm just going to quickly search up his buy now really quick. Um, uh, this is slow. Sorry if you can hear me. I still got a little bit of cold. Um, Oh, yeah, and happy Halloween. I guess that's today. I'm doing this uh, the day before. Uh, as you can see, he's about... Oh, that one's pretty cheap. Um, he's about 29k. That one's... Uh, I would probably sell him for 28750 So what you're going to want to do is go on your calculator and uh, put in 27... I think it was... Yeah, it was 28750 And uh, then divide that by 0.95. And then uh, that should be... That's the price that you're going to... That's the bare minimum that you're n you're not gonna make any money on it, or you won't, but you won't lose any money. So I'm gonna quickly just go on my calculator. Uh, twenty-eight seven fifty times point nine five. Um, that's just to get rid of the tax. So twenty-seven thousand three hundred forty or three hundred and uh, twelve coins. So you're gonna want it minus about like fifteen hundred to two k, which is about the. 
mount that a CDM card is. So I'm just going to search them up for uh, 25k or 25500 which is going to make you about 1 to 2k, which isn't the greatest, but it's a consistent profit, um, which is never a bad thing. So let's go 25k. Um, and then you can also do this with wingers. Um, I wouldn't do this with the left back or right back, but as you can see, there isn't too many up. So I'm going to go to uh, 25,750. It's uh, a little bit difficult to find some players. Oh, okay, like, hey, that one was, that's decent. Um, I'll just probably bid on them because I actually kind of need a gun to gun for the team that I'm making. Um, I'm going to have them in uh, the 4 2 2 2, so the two center defensive mids. <coughs> Sorry about that, but uh, I'll just quickly show you an example of a right wing to right mid. I'll just go with uh, the pace whore. Um I'm pretty sure Walcott's uh, right wing. Or, yeah, so I'm going to switch him to a... He's going to be switched to a right mid. I don't know if that card... I'm having troubles here. Um, I don't know if that card's too much money, but uh, I'm pretty sure it should be around 1 to 2k. I think. Maybe, maybe not. Um, but Walcott, I would probably say he's probably about 5k i have no idea i haven't looked them up at all this year um let's quickly go max buy now people aren't really i guess people are still going for pace but not as much this year so let's go 6100 is his lowest buy now in the right wing so uh or that isn't his lowest buy now but you get the point um so there isn't any in the right mid so let's go he's probably going to be about 7 to 8k um, yeah, 7,400, that's a lot of them, so it's probably about 7k. Let's quickly go to 7. Still a lot, I think, I think I saw like a, oh, shit. Um, I think I saw like 64, 6,300, so, yeah, as you can see, that's about as average as 63. So, I'm going to quickly look them up in, uh, for under 63, so I would say 53 and lower, just kind of have a cushion. You don't have to completely do math, but you just have to kind of uh, kind of round it off so you know you're going to make a profit. You don't have to exactly calculate every time during like the round of 15 or 5K around there because you soon uh, are going to learn how to, you're going to pick up uh, some tips around like about what player, what prices they're going to be around. So I'm going to add a bunch of these guys to my watch list and uh, I'm... These guys have kind of long buy or uh, wait times, and I don't really have completely them enough time to uh, wait for them to all go through. But uh, and then you can do that with the left wing, and then I'll quickly. Um, there isn't too many center forwards, so I wouldn't necessarily do it in a center forward to striker. Um, maybe Cam to center forward to striker players, but uh, it's kind of hard to find some center forwards. Um, Kind of drawing a blank on center forwards. Oh, yeah, I have to reset it. Because uh, I think it's only the 4 3, three uh, 5, which is the false 9 that has center forwards. I know Rossi's a center forward, but he's not worth, like, too much. Um, I think Cassano's center forward, but he's not worth anything. Botang's regular cam. Uh, maybe Chikawi. Um, he's probably not necessarily... Uh, dressed to like be number one player that you're gonna be wanting to get on a skill team. So this is there isn't too many center forwards in this game. So I wouldn't necessarily go for center forward to striker. I think Quintwe ah, Quint Quintero is a center forward maybe. Um, but it's a little bit difficult to find. Um, I'm just gonna quickly look on Fighthead if there's any like good center forwards. Um, really quickly, let's go FIFA's 14 search. Um, strikers, uh, um, positions, sorry that I'm talking like this, uh, but I'm just drawing a blank on people with center forwards, so there is Luis Suarez, which is 70k, Wayne Rooney, Gareth Bale, Lionel Messi, um, and that's basically it for center forwards that you're going to be wanting to pick up, really, um, there is the inform and Andrei Voronin, or uh, the one that plays for uh, Dominic, or uh, the Dominico Mosh, it's something in the Russian league, I can't remember its name right now, but uh, I'll quickly look that up just to put in an informed player, uh, Vor, 
four. Um, where is he? There he is. Um, let's see. Let's go min price. Probably nobody's going to be wanting to switch him to a striker because he probably isn't necessarily wanted. Um, I guess people did switch him to a striker, but yeah, as you can see, he's going for about 19k. Let's quickly just uh, scoot this up a little bit. Uh, let's go about there and max buy now. <sighs> Wish I had three hands. Um, <laughs> just trying to use my mouse. Um, I'm going to be trying to get a blue snowball soon. I don't know when, but uh, I'm going to be trying to get one. Let's see. It's about 10 minute video, so I'm probably going to cut it off pretty soon. But uh, as you can see, it's about 17,000. This might be price fixed. Looks like it. Yeah, it looks pretty price fixed. Um, except for that one. But uh, you kind of get the point, um, uh, hopefully. Um, you can also do... This would be a pretty difficult method to do, but um, you can probably maybe be able to switch uh, the chemistry styles in between this form or uh, trading method. Kind of intertwining, but... Um, after my Juventus series is done, I'm going to probably be switching to Borussia Dortmund. Just, it just seems the most logical team to, uh, pick. I was going to pick Manchester City, but they have, uh, pretty much nobody, nobody on the left wing. And, uh, <laughs> I don't even know why I did that. Um, but as you can probably guess, like, just by me telling you, um, they have, like, nobody on the left wing, and, uh, they have... One of their top players in uh, Jesus Navas on the right wing, so it wouldn't really make sense to do that team until uh, Sinclair got back from uh, loan, which is at the end of the season. And uh, there's a little sneak peek of the team that I'm making. It's going to be, I think it's going to be Alonso, um, whatever his name is, and uh, Di Maria uh, Gundogan. Let's see how about on the Gundogan right now. Um, six minutes, fifteen. So you kind of get the point. I hopefully, if you guys have a, any questions for me, please drop them in the comments below. And uh, thank you for helping me get partnered yet again. And I'll talk to you guys later.